Hi, boys and girls. Today we're going to read a book together called No Matter What, and it's by Debbie Gliori. And here are the characters. This is small, and this is large. That's how sometimes babies think of us. It's just bigger and large. And here's small, and here's large talking on the phone. Small was feeling grim and grumpy. Good grief, said Large. What is the matter? Look what Small has done. Totally messed up the room and turned the water over and sitting under the bucket. Goodness. I'm grim and grumpy, said Little Small, and I don't think you love me at all. Oh, Small, said Large, grumpy or not, I'll always love you, no matter what. If I were a grumpy grizzly bear, would you still love me? Would you still care? Of course, said Large, bear or not. I'd always love you, no matter what. But if I turned into a squishy bug, would you still love me and give me a hug? See the squishy bug? Here's Large. Of course, said Large, bug or not, I always love you, no matter what. No matter what, said Small with a smile. What if I were a crocodile? I'd still hold you close and snug and tight and tuck you up in bed each night. See her tucking him up? But does love wear out? Does it break or bend? Can you fix it or patch it? Does it mend? With time together, a smile and a kiss, love can be mended with things like this. Sitting in front of a fire, reading books, helping repair toys. But what about when you're far away? Does your love go too? Or does it stay? Look up at the stars. They're far, far away. But their light reaches us at the end of each day. See the stars? It's like that with love, we may be close, we may be far, but our love still surrounds us wherever we are. See, she's holding small on her lap. A little book about big worries that sometimes children have. It's a great book, no matter what. Until we read together again next time, Bye-bye.